Hello, hello, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be cash stuffing, cash stuffing bleh, 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 my first paychecks for February. So if you're interested, let's go ahead and count this money. Okie dokie. So like I said, I'm going to be doing my first paycheck for February. And this paycheck was rough because I got paid on like Wednesday. <laughs> Today of me filming this is Friday. I'm going to unstuff my wallet while I'm talking. But yeah, so I got paid on Wednesday. And I have been so busy, you guys, that I have not had time to film. So I'm like filming Friday morning before going to work because I really want to get my fun Friday video posted today. But in order to do that, I need my rollover funds. And so because it's Friday, I got paid on Wednesday, I've still been using the leftover, the rollover money that I had in my wallet. <sighs> so I would have had more rollover, but because I didn't get a chance to cash stuff, I've just been using the money that I had in here. So I have $10 left in food. And I have 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So $26. That's awesome. Considering the fact that I've, again, like I said, been using my leftover money for the last couple days. <laughs> so then nothing left in here. All right. And then... Let's see, where's my money? Oh my goodness. I should probably have the money that I'm going to use for today. <laughs> uh, all right, so today I'm going to be cash stuffing, I think it's 583, but let's make sure. 51, 52, 53, 50, so 350, 370, 390, 410, 430, 450, 470, 490, 500, 5, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 1, 2, 3. Okay, good. Yeah, 583. Okay, because I had to pay myself back. So I took like the $40 out of my medical funds and put it in the bag just so that I didn't pull that money out again later um and i will not be stuffing all of this today because again some of this will go over into my rollover not my rollover into my sinking funds so i'm gonna start with my wallet so beauty is going to get 50 one two three four four hair and 48, 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 20, 45, 6, 7, 8. Okay, and that's for nails, which I do need to get my nails done like yesterday. I think I'm going to get them sh shortened a little bit. Food gets 60. Oh, and somebody asked me about this in the comments. Like, how do you eat off $60? <laughs> this, I forgot. This food money here is for, like, going out. This is not, like, what I actually buy groceries with. This is for going out. So, I try to, you know, stick below this $60 range. Miscellaneous is going to get 50 I think I just did a 50 this time. Oh, and there's my heater. Gas is going to get 60. I ended up using all my gas money this time. I had $20 left over. But again, because I didn't <laughs> do my cash stuffing, I just had to use the $20 in cash that I had. So I will probably have quite a bit left over this next time. Unless I have to do a lot of driving this week. Giving is going to get its usual five. And the giving folder is hilarious because lately I've just been giving it to my students 
for various things, school dances, or if they do something really well, like a test or something, like I give them, I call it their payday, and they get so excited. So normally that goes to my students. <laughs> all right, and then what's this one? I'm trying to remember like what all my binders are. Okay, I'm not stuffing this one this time. I'm stuffing this one this time. All right, so Treat Yourself is going to get 10. And I did not update my trackers, so I'll have to do that later. So now this has 50, 70, 80. I'll do that off camera. Travel is going to get 50. We are getting so close to go wild. So, so, so close. So travel now has 1, 2, 3, 54, 55, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, which is great. This amount right here basically goes towards, will pay for my flight. Gifts is going to get 25. my mom and my brother in February. Bills is going to get 10. I did have to take from this 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 because I had an unexpected expense come up. So I'm grateful that I had money here. Debt is going to get 20. And my plan is to keep this until the end of the year and just make one like large payment, 20, 40, 60, 80. Instead of doing like I was doing before and doing it like month to month, I just want to make like one large payment. Medical is going to get 10. I've had a lot of medical expenses lately. Hey, let me know if you guys are cash stuffers like for medical. Do you guys take like if you go get vitamins or anything like that do you take it out of your medical envelope or do you literally just use this for like because i really only use mine for like copays and like prescribed meds i don't really use it for my regular stuff but comment down below if you use yours for like any type of medical anything band-aids whatever let me know because i'm curious 20 40 60 70 1 2 3 because i'm like the the message the medicine that I use for like my acid reflux it's like $20 a bottle like $20 <laughs> so I'm like right now I've been taking it out of my like household aka grocery fund I'm like should I be taking that out of medical I don't know car is going to get 10 so now it has 20 30 35 and 40 And then abundance is my emergency fund, except for I don't call it that. <laughs> it's my abundance fund because I do not want to plan for any emergencies because I would rather not have any emergencies. So this money is extra to do whatever needs to be done. And that is the end of that. And then I think I put those in here. The monthly, yes, okay. So for January is done. Now we are on to February. And two, these are available in my shop. Right now I have them down as the digital download, but I think I'm gonna also list them as like print and ship so mine is like laminated so that's going to get 50 50 dollars in that one it looks like i did something wrong but oh no i'm good okay that's probably good enough Alrighty, so there is 
that. February is done. And then, and that money will uh, more than likely go towards debt as well at the end of the year. All right, and then last but not least, I have my 50 envelope challenge, which is also available on my shop. So I'm going to kind of be changing this because I was watching Budget with Bay, and she, one of her lovely subscribers, <laughs> informed her that if you basically start from the last envelope to the first envelope, the amount is always the same. So 50, I wish I wouldn't have done that in black. 50 plus one is 51. 49 plus two is 51. 48 plus three is 51 and so on and so forth. So that'll be easier for me to know that I just need to stuff $51 every single time. And then that way, A, I don't have to keep up with all those other little envelopes. And B, I won't get to a point where now I have to stuff 45 and 46 at the same time because that happened to me a couple of times last year. And then I was like scrambling, trying to find different envelopes so that I didn't have to do that. So $51. Ooh, that's like an ancient 50. It's going to go in here because my one is already done. I almost kind of want to round this to 55. Do I have a five? I'm not a big fan of these. Eh. Mm. Eh, it's okay. We'll just leave it. Because it's just $1. So like the next time I cash stuff 51, it'll go into the 49 and then 40, you know, until I get back to, uh, what was it, number six. Then I'll be back in order. <laughs> So then I'll put, you know, some over here and then some back here. And once I get up to six, I might start doing, I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, that's that 50 envelope challenge. So then what I have left is 20, 40, 45, 50. And then with rollover, I have 10, 20, 30, oh no, 50, 60, 70, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So $86 will then go to my savings challenges and my rollover money. And that is it, you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I know it was very quick, but I have to film another one right now. So, <laughs> and then go to work for the day. So thank you so much for tuning in with me. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, again, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so, and hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. As always, please, please, please be safe, be kind, or be quiet, be well, and I'll catch you in the next one.